Hey, hey, what is up, Swef Games here, and today I'm bringing you a Battlefield 1 video, so just first thing before we start this video, thanks Danny on PC for the gameplay, so link in the description for his channel, so now let's just get right into the video. Okay, so this video is going to be on the Battlefield 1 Operations mode that is going to be new to the Battlefield franchise, and this is probably the thing I am most excited for for Battlefield 1. So for those of you who do not know what this mode is, it's supposed to be a very large scale multi-map frontline objective where you fight on a frontline to take over an objective, kind of like Rush but much more large scale, and kind of trying to emulate some of the battles that went on during World War Okay, so recently there was a post on the Battlefield website on the operations mode a bit more in-depth than what we knew before because what I told you was pretty much known for a while but now recently there's a little bit more in-depth information on how this mode works so as said before you got your two teams and spanning from map to map there are certain points that defenders have to take over and hold from the attacking team so assuming the attacking team can push up and take these objectives they move on to the next map where they get the attackers keep moving on and the defenders kind of fall back re make their positions with stationary turrets hopefully they actually work and are in reasonable spots hopefully but it does sound like they will be unlike in battlefield 4 and the attackers have to pretty much push up on those trenches and take the points of interest and then the process keeps repeating for a little so pretty much DICE wanted to make a lar larger of a battlefield experience that also lasted more than just like 40 minutes at most, which this article is stating will be at least an hour long, which really excites me that we will have more than just a simple conquest match that lasts generally from 20 to 30 minutes and occasionally will span a little bit longer than that. Okay, so I'm going to go over a few reasons why I'm really looking forward to this mode. So one reason is the frontline aspect of it. So one thing is I don't really get that like there's a front line in conquest that never really happens because it's all the points of like back capping so anyone everyone really just scatters out there's not really a front line except excluding a few maps like operation locker and operation metro and also there's a few others but generally it's all very clustered out and wide open which i mean i think is cool at least in the vehicle aspects but at least if i'm playing infantry i kind of like everyone to be focused on a front line which rush does but it's just not good rush just hasn't been as good as it's been in the past also another thing i'm looking forward to with this game is having the longer game modes which i get it. there is a good reason to have the 15 20 30 minute rounds which if I only have maybe half an hour to do something those games work really good but sometimes I just can sit down and play for a few hours I don't want to keep restarting games every 20 minutes and a mode like this would be really nice for that so the last reason I'm gonna bring up in this video or it's kind of two is that it's based upon real that some of these at least are gonna be based upon real battles and that's just something new which I think playing over some of the iconic battles during World War One would be really cool and enjoyable to do. And also to bring up the other point of that's just something new to do. I mean, we've already had Rush, and we there's just still a good chance we'll probably have it. But just having something different that's still different. It's generally not that vehicle-oriented, but it sounds like at least for this, that this operations game mode is supposed to be a lot more about the vehicles than just infantry where rush was a lot more focused on so i hope you guys all enjoyed this video and if you did please drop a like if you want to see more battlefield content coming up in the next few weeks since the beta is coming out please subscribe and also if you just want to see other videos along the lines of like battlefield 4 and airsoft also hit that subscribe button so see you later swef games out